So I want to install the Sparkfun KiCad libraries to my KiCad installation. So the first step is to download the zip file. So just click on, oops, go back up here. Click on clone or download, get the zip file. And I downloaded it here in my downloads folder and then expanded the archive. And this directory contains the footprints and the libraries. So next thing to do is to go into PCB new, then into preferences and the footprint libraries manager. Then in here, say append with wizard. Files are on my computer, so click on next. And I'll browse to the location of my files. So it is this directory here, get inside. Since I'm using PCB new, I want to import the footprints first. So you can see that this directory has got lots of footprints. So I want to select all of them. So I'm holding down the shift key on my keyboard. I'll go down to the bottom. So I can see the, the last folder of the contents of this folder and holding the shift key down i'm going to click on switches.pretty and now i've got them all selected and click on next so it's found all of the libraries that i've selected and all of them have got components so uh, footprint footprint components so click on next and yes sure i'd like to put them in the global library so that all my projects can use these new footprints and finish done i've got a few duplicates because i did the test earlier so aesthetics comes in twice which is fine click ok uh, yep i actually did that a few times Let's see. Uh, all right so i need to remove one of the aesthetics as <laughs> you can see here 82 and 83 has got two aesthetics. So just to remove one of them, I will click on remove library, done. And that should do it. You should pay attention to error messages. Let's check it out now. Let's say I'm going to select by browser and use the aesthetics uh, libraries uh, components that I imported earlier. Let's check out what else do we have inside footprints. Let's see for batteries as well. Let's check out batteries. There's batteries. This is also part of the SparkFun uh, download. Let's check for one more at least. Let's go for displays. And there's displays also from SparkFun. All right, so this looks like it's this part is complete. We've imported the footprint libraries from the Sparkfun archive. What about the schematics? So I'm going to bring up uh, EE schema and I'm going to try the same process. Go into preferences, component libraries, and let's say that we want to add. I'm going to navigate to my downloads folder. Uh, SparkFun, libraries, and see if I can select all of them using the same technique. Yep, so holding down the shift key, select all of the lib.lib .lib files and click on open. And you can see them here. Now let's see if this is actually, this has actually worked. So I'll click on OK. And Let's see if we can select, say, um, aesthetics. There you go, spark fun, aesthetics. And there you go, you, you have all these items now. I can drop them off right there. Let's do one more. Let's go for GPS. Let's pick that. There you go, okay. Awesome, so it looks like it is actually working. And I've now imported both the libraries and the footprint components 
into my KiCad installation and I can use it.